With the sun, the scenery and laid-back top-end lifestyle, the Territory has always been a popular place for a working holiday. But over recent years, fewer backpackers have made the trip north and it's a trend tourism NT is determined to reverse. It happens every dry. The quiet, wet season streets are transformed into a bustling hub of activity as backpackers flock to Darwin to experience northern Australia. You haven't done the real Australia until you've done the NT, really. But recently, numbers of working tourists making the trip to the top end have been on the decline, and it's our local businesses that are feeling the pinch. It's been quite time in Australia for the last year, all up, so Northern Territory is at the back end of that hard time. So yeah, definitely looking for an upturn in the market. To lure the masses north, a backpacker roadshow has taken to the streets of Melbourne using tourism NT and local operators to sign up potential visitors. We really want to get them coming up to the NT, especially coming into our dry season. Um, everyone down here is going to be cold where we're going to be soaking it up and just loving life in general, I think. More than 60 youth travel agents will attend the rolling event. The aim? To get them to sell the territory. A lot of our backpackers come over and have heard of the East Coast. They know they want to go to Fraser Island with Sundays. But actually what they really want is to see that big red rock that they've seen on TV in the Abbots and the kangaroos and the waterfalls and everything else that isn't necessarily offered in all of the surface paradise and the touristy towns. From here, the roadshow will head to Sydney and then Byron Bay over the next week. And if successful, Darwin could see backpackers heading north within the month. Backpackers are in demand and the Territory needs to compete with the East Coast market, which is enjoying strong growth in international tourist numbers. Adding to that challenge, outside factors like visa difficulties and the impending backpacker tax, which would see working foreigners taxed more. That's providing active uh, discouragement uh, to backpackers who want to come to Australia and want to come to the Northern Territory. And we need as many workers as possible. It's more than just the money they spend. Working visitors help fill the shortage of labour over the busy season. These um, people do stay longer, they spend a lot, and they're also really important to helping us fill uh, those vital jobs in the tourism uh, industry as well. The Backpacker Roadshow runs until April 8th. In Melbourne, Amy Colbert, Nine News.